Hello everybody, this is Katie Jacobson, the Internet Marketing Strategist, founder of Precision Marketing Academy and leader of the Momentum Marketers Alliance, where I work with Garrett White and Adam Spiel to teach and train modern entrepreneurs in the three critical skills needed in business, certainty in the marketplace, modern marketing, and strategic sales. I am here today in this video to teach you how to set up your Solovey landing page from start to finish. I will go rather quickly so that we can get through the video to see what you're going to need to do and then go back to the beginning, um, pause it after every step, complete the step, and then go on. All right, we're going to start at www.solovey.com and you will click on About Solovey and Brand Tools. Okay, right here is the landing page template installation guide. That is a fantastic PDF that Solovey has put together. So you may want to look at that. And then you will click here on templates, click to just download automatically or right click and do a save link as to choose where to save it. I am going to save it on my desktop. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and open up the installation guide. And you can see here, Solovey suggests that you work with Bluehost or Dreamhost. I'm going to go to the Dreamhost website that you recommend. Um, we're just going to go to dreamhost.com. meant to type that in up there, but okay, dreamhost.com. They offer a two-week free trial. And we're actually going to go to dreamhost.com forward slash WordPress, which is the link that Solove recommends. Okay, that's where we want to be. Dreamhost.com forward slash WordPress. Try us for two weeks. You can start your free trial right here. And you'll need to sign up with an email and password. I am going to go ahead and complete this page and then come back to the video. All right, my username and email, or my email and password have been accepted, and so now we end up with the sign up form. We're going to register a new domain, so I will, you may need to try a few before you come up with one that's not taken yet. I'm going to try unlimited4gfree.com. Let's see if that's available. Okay, that's available. I'm going to go ahead and go with, um, let's see, we need to pick a hosting plan. You can do a year prepaid at 120 for nine, or, which is 9.95 a month, or you can go monthly and with a $50 setup. Okay, the one or two years prepaid are going to be the best deal here, and they do have a free trial, so you can try it out for a couple of weeks. We'll continue on with that. And I'm going to fill out the credit card billing information and then you will see me on the next screen. All right, on this screen we will pick a server username and put in some, uh, some other questions. And we, we don't need to put anything in how did you hear about us. You could put Solovey there and there is no promo code or email check off the terms and conditions and hit continue and I will do that and see you on the next page. Okay, on this screen, this is just your standard payment information. I will fill that out and see you on the next screen. All right, I'll hit continue and see what we get. Okay, you do not need to add anything else, private web server or MySQL server, so we'll do continue. And you do not need to add any of these things. Um, this Gmail and Google Apps is free, so we'll leave that checked. All right, we are in to DreamHost now, and we can continue on to setting up our WordPress blog and our Solovey landing page. Okay, so click on Continue to your web panel, and log in with the information that you just selected. I will do that, hit log in, and see you on the next screen. Okay, we are now into the DreamHost panel, and you can 
access this later by going to panel.dreamhost.com and you will click over here on the left on one click installs. Okay, we're going to go down to WordPress and you can do, let's see, um, Okay, we'll click on custom installation here. Install to, select the domain that you chose. And if you want to have something else on that domain later, you may want to install this to a subdirectory. So I'm going to choose, we'll just try landing page for now. Automatically create database, leave this checked and install it for me now. Okay, so it says WordPress will be installed to my website forward slash landing page within 10 minutes. You will then receive an email. So check your email and I will pause and get that and come back to here. Okay, I have received the email now. So if you go into the email, it says please create an admin user at and it gives you a page. So we'll click on that. Oops, it's not, looks like it's not quite up yet. We'll wait a few more minutes and come back. Okay, I left this all night, and when I came back in the morning, I refreshed the link that they had given me in my email, and I got to this screen. Okay, so we're going to want to fill in the name of our site. You can use whatever you want. You can change this later. This is what will show up on tabs in browsers. Um, you can leave your username as admin or change it to your first name or something you can remember and set a password. Double check your email address because this is where they will send you your password if you need it and allow search en engines to index this site and then install WordPress. Okay, success! WordPress has been installed username admin and it does not tell you your password you'll have to remember that okay click log in and in the future this is where you can come to log in to your WordPress and set up or change your landing page okay so you want to use the name you just chose and log in All right, now we will come over here to Appearance on the left side, hover over that, and click Themes. The soul of a landing page is a WordPress theme. And you can only have one WordPress theme on a site. So this is the only thing that will be able to be on the site unless you use the forward slash with a name as I showed you earlier. Okay, we're going to click on Install Themes. and then click Upload. Then choose the file, find where you uh, put that file before. The zip file that we downloaded from Solovey, it's called Solovey Single Page. Select it, choose Open, Install Now. And you must click on Activate. Okay, we're up. There are three layouts. The first one has a small uh, graphic on half the screen here, and then a personal welcome message from you here. This one has a full width video on the upper half, and this one has the banner graphic and small video. If you select the banner graphic and welcome message, then on the next, uh, the next step, you select which graphic you like. So you can choose either one. You do not have any other way to upload them, but you can choose one of these. And then here is where you would type in your personal message that they're going to see. Okay, if we select the full width intro video, you can choose which video you want to use. And then if we select the banner graphic and intro video, we can select which banner graphic and which video. Okay, and then you come down here, fill out your information, 
uh, your email address, and this is where you will be contacted if someone puts their name and, and phone number, or sorry, their name and email in on your page. That is the website where you will be contacted. So you can fill all of this out. I'm going to finish filling it out, and I'm going to come back to the photo pay or the photo option in a minute. Okay, right here on your photo, you'll want to click on Upload Image. If you do not, you'll just get the little purple soul of a man. Um, this takes you to your WordPress media library. It's basically what we're doing here is adding something to the WordPress media library. So you select your file. Um, I'm going to do that, find that one, and come back. Okay, so I've found my picture that I want to use, and I'm going to click Open. Okay, so it uploads my picture right here, and then it appears there, okay? And what you want to do is click Use This Image. Okay, and then check to make sure that's the new image. It should have the name that, that, that you used here at the end. If you don't click Use Image on the previous page, it won't work. All right, and then Save Changes. Okay, now you are done. You can view your page easily just by hovering over this right here and click Visit Site. And you should see your graphic. This clicks on a link to a PDF, your video from Ryan that you can play. They can look at the phones, um, compensation plan, there's PDFs that they can download. And then over here, you'll see your picture, name, and you'll notice that my email gets cut off. So it'll still work just fine, but they can't really see it. You may want to use a shorter one so that that, does, that doesn't happen. It'll automatically bring in your Twitter feed if you have set Twitter up. And then when someone puts in their name and email and clicks Get in Touch, you will receive an email from them. You can update this page from any computer anytime simply by going to the address. So this is the address that we set up earlier. And at the end, type in WP, which is WordPress admin. That should take you to the login screen if you're not already logged in. Since we are, it takes us back to the admin page. And again, to review, to set this up, you go to Appearance, Theme Options. We've already downloaded the theme, so it just shows up there automatically now. So Theme Options. And we're back to this screen where we can choose different layouts. I hope this has been helpful. If you are still not able to set yours up or you would like somebody else to do it for you, I do offer that service for a small fee. There will be contact information below or next to this video so you can contact me about that. You can also connect with me on my Facebook page, which is facebook.com forward slash Katie Jacobson Coaching. Uh, Katie is K-A-T-I-E and Jacobson is J-A-C-O-B-S-E. E N so forward slash Katie Jacobson coaching and then you can get other tutorials and internet marketing tips from me at, that will help you with your soul of a business I hope you have great success in your business and that this landing page helps you talk to you later